Hello, my name is Dirk Cobry. Today I'm going to show you how to install MOBA XPerm, one piece of software that should cover everything you need to do to connect to the High Performance Computing Center. First thing we need to do is go to the MOBA XTERM website. It's our first tab here. And I want to download. I'm going to download the free version, though you may want to consider downloading the professional version. Uh, save that to the desktop. Now we can close my web browser and there's MOBA XTERM. Let's double click on it. Extract all the files. Double click on MOBA XTERM Personal and run it. Windows Firewall will try to uh, block it, but we know we want to access the internet, so we'll allow it access. And we are now connected to MOBA XTERM. So let's close these extra windows. Uh, to connect to the High Performance Computing Center, all you do is type ssh, your username, at hpcc.msu.edu. Type in your MSU password. And quick as that, we are logged on to the HPC. But what's great about MOBA XTERM is we also have access to uh, X11 graphical user interfaces. So let's ssh to one of the dev nodes and run a graphics program, I just will run MATLAB. And there is MATLAB uh, running on the HPC, but the graphical user interface is now available to me on my local Windows machine. Let's exit. And now we're back onto our host machine. Uh, you can also use MOBA XTERM to transfer files. The command we use is called secure copy or SCP. Um, you can list what files are in your local directory. You can see if I do an LS, I see my, my desktop, uh, a launch folder in my documents. If I want to go to my desktop, for example, uh, those are the files that are currently on my desktop. I'm going to use the MOBA text editor to create a really quick file. This is going to be a submission strip that will um, just run on whatever node is available. and cd to the working directory and run the command qstat and return. So it pretty much does nothing except run the command qstat. I'm going to save this file. I'm going to save it to my desktop as we'll call it test.qsub. And now we can close MOBA xterm editor and if I do an ls and cd to my desktop do another list I will see somewhere in here test.qsub now to copy that file over to the HPC we use a command called secure copy or SCP uh, the file name that we want to copy and the destination we want to go to. In our case, the destination, uh, we have to include our username at hpcc.msu.edu and then you use a colon and the directory where you want to put that file. You can do mount home colbury di slash test.qsub. So I want to take test.qsub 
put it on the High Performance Computing Center, and copy it to my top level home directory. It'll ask for my HPC password. And now we've copied it. I can use the up arrow in Mobile Xterm to go through my commands that I previously ran. And if I quickly run through it, I'm I want to SSH back into the HPC. Type my password. And if I do an ls and grep for the test.qsub, well, I actually have a lot of test.qsub, so let's make sure it's the right one. And there's the command we just run. And I actually noticed an error. Uh, it's usually good to put a extra carriage return at the end of the command. So let's go back to MOBA Xterm Editor. Open our file back up again. And add an extra carriage return at the end of the key sub file. Save it. And I'm just gonna do I'm just going to do a new session, CD to my desktop again. And copy that file over. This time I'm just gonna use a tilde, which is a shortcut for doing mount home. And uh, copy the file over. Now, when I go back here and I cat the same file, it has a it has the extra carriage returns that I wanted. And now that I'm here, I can actually queue sub the file if I wanted to. So this is how you use MOBA X term as a single software install to do everything you need to to transfer files and use the High Performance Computing Center.